Okay, are you ready? Sometimes the greatest questions of history turn on the smallest things. Sam Houston became known as the father of modern Texas, but it wouldn't have happened if Sam Houston's wedding night had gone better. Sam Houston was the governor of Tennessee. He fell in love with a young woman named Eliza Allen. They were married and they began what Sam Houston thought, hoped, would be a life of marital bliss. But on the first night, something went wrong. We historians still don't know. We'd like to know, everybody would like to know, but we don't know exactly what went wrong, but it went very badly wrong. And Sam Houston's marriage fell apart within weeks. Sam Houston was absolutely mortified. He abandoned Nashville, the Tennessee capital. He fled the state. He spent the next three years roaring drunk. Finally, he managed to pull himself out of this inebriated haze and said, I've got to do something to, to reclaim my life. I've got to do something to make the world think better of me. I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to Texas. Houston went to Texas. He decided that Texas needed to be seized from Mexico and added to the United States. This was the goal of Houston's post-marriage career. Texans today should acknowledge their debt to Eliza Allen for changing Sam Houston's life. The University of Texas in particular should grant Eliza Allen status as the most famous Texas ex. The rest is history.